How's it going, everybody? Good morning, afternoon, and or evening. Whenever you're watching, it is 11. Car Talk 11. It is currently 5.34 in the morning. Driving to the gym, like usual. Uh, <sighs> had a pretty good sleep last night. Actually woke up before my alarm. But then went back to bed, sorta. Woke up again when my alarm went off. Like, I woke up at like 4.11 and my alarm goes off at 4.45, so it wasn't like, yeah, I lost on a tiny bit of sleep, but not really. Had some Vector cereal, some milk with 18 grams of protein, so I'm probably, I'm probably rocking like 30 grams of protein before the gym. I got my pre-workout shake. Today is chest and abs, I mean, not chest, shoulders and abs day. So, pretty light, one of the lightest days in the fucking, in the workout. But I mean, yesterday was the heaviest, so, I mean, it kind of evens itself out. You know, legs and then fucking shoulders. Um, I did my cardio yesterday. 300 calories in 30 minutes, under 30 minutes. That's that's my goal every time I uh, I do cardio. So I'm glad I was able to achieve that. I think I got it in 29 minutes and 30, so decent. Um, how are you guys doing? I usually don't, I don't really, I mean I do ask that, but yeah. Also, comment down below your guys' split. Um, I've never really, I don't think I've ever like fully said my split. My split is chest, triceps, first day, back, biceps, second day, legs, third day, shoulders, abs, fourth day, chest and back, fifth day, and then arms, last day. So, it's pretty, pretty okay uh, split. It's, I love my split. I mean, I, I will eventually change it around. But right now it's perfect for me, so. Yeah. Um, I've been doing pretty good on uh, all of my goals. Um, still watching The Sopranos, still going to work, still going to the gym. Doing all the things I need to. So, it's great. I am very, very much looking forward to continuing this grind that I've had for a while. I mean, I just, I really like the feeling of waking up early in the morning, eating food, and then going to the gym, and then... I mean, I don't like work, but, you know, I do like getting paid. And I am really trying to save money. So, I've said to myself already, I'm going to make one more pretty big purchase, and then I'm not spending any money. Besides on absolute emergency purchases or food. So, yeah. Driving, driving at five in the morning is just so relaxing, man. Like, there's like, there's like four cars on the road, like, during my road to Brad's house. Of course, this one fucking main road is being, being worked on for no reason. So, that's why you hear this while I'm driving. There's fucking cones everywhere. Like, seriously, man. Like, why do they need to fucking do this shit? Like, can't they, like, you know, just live with the normal road? Like, sometimes I just don't fucking understand why they, why they have to do, why they have to repave a road. 
like, okay, yeah, there might be, like, a couple cracks in the road or something. But the road's still fucking functional, you know? And plus, the road wasn't even bad, like, honestly. There was barely anything wrong with the road. Of course, the road back there that's, like, almost fully complete is way smoother and shit. But, man... I have to fucking drive this road every goddamn day to get to work and to get to fucking LA Fitness. And this shit is fucking annoying as fuck. Speaking of fucking annoying as fuck, World Gym. Um, I am planning on, um, I'm planning on getting a new gym membership probably next spring. LA is a good membership and all, but it's fucking expensive as shit. And World Gym is six dollars a week. Six dollars a week times four. That's twenty four dollars. Twenty four dollars a month. LA is like fucking fifty dollars. A month. So, I mean, you know. I'm gonna, I, if I would ever get a World Gym membership, I'd ask if they could take my, uh, membership fee every month. <laughs> just to make it easier on billing, but, I mean, still. I could just, I could literally just do, like, the... Like, the not, um, membership, whatever it's called. Uh, the no initiation or whatever. Because the no initiation is only, like, ten bucks more. So, like, it's honestly not even that bad of a fucking gamble. I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna take a sip of my pre- So guys, you know what, I'm going to rate this pre-workout from 1 to 10. So. The taste. It's pretty accurate to what it's trying to do, which is like a, a grape bubble gum, like a big league chew kind of thing. Or hubba bubba, but like grape flavored. It tastes pretty fucking similar. I don't know how they get that, like, powdered taste so well. But it does taste powdery. It, it like, uh, like that, that fucking, like, powdered sugar that's on all the gum. Like, that's why it reminds me of Big League Chew, because of the powder, the powderiness. But yeah, it's pretty good, actually. got a lot of caffeine in it. I use my Batch 27 scooper, um, which is, uh, I think it's 17.3 grams per scoop, and the normal rise, I'm gonna miss the light, the normal rise is, like, more than that, or less than that, sorry, it's, like, it's, like, 14 grams or something, which is, like, you know, almost the same, but I get, like, probably, like, 0.2 grams more of beta and, like, 20 milligrams more caffeine and all that shit and L-sertraline and all that, so. <laughs> that shit pumps you, though, let me tell you. I'm really used to beta. I barely even feel beta. Like, I feel it for maybe, like, 50 seconds in the parking lot and then it goes away but I love I actually really like the feeling of beta like it makes me like feel pumped I don't like like a crazy amount of beta but a like not a tiny bit I like a lot of beta like it, but it doesn't hit me hard so you know like 4 grams of beta it's pretty good I know Sam takes, like, 10 grams of beta in his shakes, which is, like, I mean, honestly, it's 
probably pretty good for muscle resistance or whatever. I heard that, yeah, beta's really good for muscles. And you're supposed to take beta every day, even on your rest days, which is why you should get like a beta supplement that you can take on your rest days, but you know, really up to you on what you want to do with that. That guy, I, for some reason I thought that guy was going to run the red light. Anyways, I got a six and a half hour work day today. Pretty, that's a long ass fucking work day for me. Um, but that means, I don't even know how much I get paid per hour, honestly. Because I heard that, I heard that fucking wages are supposed to go up in Canada. But I don't know if mine have went up yet, you know? I have a pretty, like, not high paying job. My job pays, like, minimum wage, and I work part time. So, I'm not making, like, a lot of money at all right now. But I'm, I'm literally just, like, this is just like a, like a filler, you know? This is just something to earn money, you know, to earn, to make ends with my shit while I, you know, take a gap year. Next year, I'm going to go to college, get a degree in something, probably like business or something like that. But business is boring as shit, so maybe not. I don't know what I'm going to do. I really still don't know. Um, you know, I could go into web design. That'd be... No, I hate coding. I don't fucking know, man. That time will come. But yeah, I definitely do want to get a better job. Just not right now. You know? I'm kind of just waiting it out with this job. This job is literally just to afford, like, my my gym expense, my car expense. And that should be, and food, yeah. Because, you know, I'm on the bulk right now. I'm eating, like, shit every day. But not really. I'm getting my macros, getting my, my uh, fat, getting my carbs. Like, pretty, pretty good. I mean, you know, milk... Milk is very good for fucking protein, right? I drink a lot of milk, and I drink a lot of, um, I mean, I eat a lot of, uh, meat and shit, and I track my macros almost every day, so just to make sure I hit my protein for the day, and to make sure I'm adequately energized by taking carbs, I mean by having a lot of carbs in my diet. I still don't want to have a lot of fat in my diet because, I mean, yeah, it's good to gain weight, but fat is hard to get off. But, I mean, that's why I have implemented cardio into the workout, into the workout sessions. Oh, yeah, so I did leg day yesterday. Um, my legs actually don't feel too sore today, which is good. I mean, I hit them pretty fucking good, so I'm actually surprised they don't really hurt that much, but they hurt a tiny bit, and I, I'd feel it if I tried to bend for a squat right now, but, you know. Anyways, um, that's going to do it for today's car talk. Um, I might do a post-workout car talk. I don't really know yet. Maybe I should do two car talks a day, you know? But if that happens, well, that happens. But hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe. Um, yeah, just have a great day. Peace.